So today we're gonna be going to the flower festival parade this weekend is like the flower festival weekend where they have like a lot of flower displays and things like that in Chiang Mai so we wanted to check it out um, and then we'll go to a fabric market called war roads market I don't know how to say it and then we will go to a temple called Doi and there is no sidewalk on this street. Just so y'all can see my view. How are we supposed to walk? fabric market. So I just met this guy today. He wants to also take a picture with me. Thanks. So we just made it to Doi Suthep Temple. The roads to get here were very windy and like it was crazy. I don't know if I've ever experienced that much winding. You buy tickets. Okay. You buy the bell Oh no, no. Write your name, go to the temple. Oh no. About to go get our tickets now to take the cable car. 
Here's the tickets they gave us. done feeding the elephants now we're gonna change into their traditional dress I think and then tie it on yeah, like so some people they always put this way you know yeah this way in front okay and then you have to put swimming so underneath okay swimming so underneath hey yo hey yo it's okay so this is the outfit that we're wearing. See my mom just has it on. <laughs> so right now we are hanging. We're hanging with the elephants. They're behind me. They're a lot bigger than I thought they would be. But they're very nice, very gentle. They're not attacking anybody. We're just feeding them bananas right now. <laughs> okay, for the baby elephant, yellow banana. Oh, 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 
Here's a baby one. Go on this side. It's annoying. You ready? <laughs> oh man, I missed it. It's a close up. Look at their feet. They're gigantic. No, no, it's, I'm cut down. Like a, I don't even want to call it a shower. We washed off in some water. In that pool. <laughs> so I feel a little bit better now. Also changed clothes, but I kind of scraped my arm right here when I fell. So now we're gonna go eat lunch. Okay, into this. Bean sprout. On top, on top. So drop this into the hot water. Okay, and then remember do not drop all the way deep down. Otherwise we're falling out. You just drop up and down like this. Okay? One, two, three, four, five. That's it. Okay, and then... More soup, more delicious. So here's the soup I made. How do you like it? She said she wants to go to McDonald's later though. <laughs> it tastes okay. Goodbye, elephants. Bye. So now we're about to leave the elephant sanctuary. I'm gonna say bye to the elephants and get back into this truck here. I'm ready to take a shower. I'm ready to take a shower so that like mud on me. She does too. I think we're gonna go to the spa next. Thailand wow. Thailand wow. 
So we just got back from the elephant sanctuary. Um, if some of y'all don't know, it's really bad for the elephants to ride on them and for them to do tricks like in circuses and things like that. So the place where we went to actually rescues those elephants from the circuses and the elephant riding camps um, and sort of just lets them live freely at like a habitat that they've created. So the company we use was Mayor Rim, I'll put the name of it right here, uh, Sanctuary. It was okay. I don't know if I would recommend them. They did the basics. So we fed the elephants. Um, we pet the elephants. We learned a little bit about the elephants there. They're not necessarily the best and they say they're not the best there. This is just one I booked last minute here. I really did enjoy though interacting with the elephants and touching them. I did not realize they were that big. The baby one was like my height <laughs> and then the other ones were like two to three times my height uh, which was crazy but then they were gentle they didn't make much noise or anything I didn't fear for my life well at first I kind of like feared getting close to them but then as I was there longer I got closer to them um, I did not want to do that mud bath thing but my mom forced me to do that and y'all saw I fell in the mud <laughs> so I was like feeling kind of uncomfortable the rest of the the trip after that but I would definitely recommend if you ever go to Thailand or anywhere where you can just go and see elephants not to ride them but to go to a sanctuary which rescues those elephants from those type of camps and abuse camps and then allows them to you know live their life freely of course they're not completely free because we go in there and we pet them but the money that we pay to do this um, is used to finance like buying the elephants from other like abuse camps and it also pays for uh, the bananas and the food that they feed the elephants and things like that just basically to operate these sanctuaries that's what they're called but yeah it was a it was oh my my but yeah it was a good experience and now we're about to head to the spa just got done with the Thai massage and foot massage and it was like great wonderful experience and now we're at the Sunday market here It is supposedly the biggest market in Chiang Mai, and I can I can see that it's pretty packed. They have food here. They have purses. They have clothes. It's supposedly bigger than the one I went to yesterday, the Saturday night market. Suwali <laughs> Noodle salad. Maybe making some noodles over there. Lots of purses.
So I decided to try this famous Thai dessert called mango sticky rice. It's like mango and rice together. <laughs> <laughs> she clearly don't doesn't like it. Hey, what's wrong with it? <laughs> I decided to get some squid here that they're cooking on the grill. So now it's about 4.30 a.m. in the morning and we're about to catch our flight to Phuket. Um, I didn't go to bed until like 11, so I'm really tired. But this was the cheapest flight we can get. But that was our last night in Chiang Mai. We stayed here for four nights and we did a lot of stuff. I'm going to end this vlog right now and I'll probably do a different vlog for uh, Phuket. In Phuket we're gonna go to Koh Phi Phi Islands and we're gonna take a canoeing trip. So that should be good. So, but yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks, bye.